we want to compare, especially the digital divide between, um, let's say, for example, EU countries and African countries, uh, sometimes we may believe that it is widening. Um, if you consider other aspects of the technology, how people are moving, how broadband is like a must now in Europe, in all, let's say, um, households in Europe, broadband is the must, and not basic broadband, but high broadband, I would say. If we consider those kind of um, advanced in the, in, the, in EU countries, for example, you may believe that uh, the digital divide seems to be wide, reducing, but at the same time, it's still widening somehow. So it is not... Um, it is not straightforward to answer that question. Okay, uh, I think we have to go on case by case, and yeah, I think we, we at City we do what we can to 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 to, to increase connectivity and not connectivity use of ICTs in rural area and uh, with the farming community with the agricultural community. But I don't know. I cannot. I don't have clear stats to say that we are we are actually. Uh, really reducing the digital device or whatever because if you consider how the world is developing we have too much advanced in the in eu countries compared to african countries with today in african countries you still for example have a key problem which is electricity lack of electricity so sometimes even people if they have the mobile phone they can't use it because they don't have um, connectivity when they or let's say electricity when they need to have that um, that available to communicate sometimes it is very very difficult to reach networks while here in europe it is quite uh, like a uh, common sense okay sometimes when you are in uh, african countries you don't have actually a real interconnections of, of network and people sometimes are obliged to have uh, three four mobile phones depending on the number of networks that are available in the countries so um i would say yes the digital device is uh, being reduced if we compare where african countries for example have been like 10 years ago to now but if you want to compare with europe the advance in the two continents for example you, you may be more um I mean, uh, it's more debatable i would say